Well, now we lost two weeks. You know, now we got to go find another lender. You know what I mean? And we're two weeks behind, and it's just a jacked up deal. This is what I believe. I'm sharing that with you for nothing. Just get out there and succeed. You know, I've got a lot of lenders that try to hit me up, right? All the time. They wanna, they wanna get my business and stuff. And the thing is, is I have such a, an incredible relationship with the guy I've done business with for 10 years. Um, you know, and uh, you know, the, here, here's, here's, okay, here, this might help. This is, you know, my little story. I, uh, I got in real estate and I tried a lot of different lenders, you know, and I would try one because they were nice and we were buddies and, you know, next thing I know, the deal is completely jacked up and I'm like, mm, you're done. And so I moved to the next one and I kind of, I kind of moved around a little until boom, you find the one that works well with you. Yeah. You know what I mean? And so, um, you know, and working well means this. The lender I have now that I've been working with for so long, he tells me up front everything that's going to happen. He can look at the person's situation and he can tell me, okay, we're going to have some problems here. I don't know about this or this, this looks great. This is when he tells me he can do it. I might as well just mark cash on the contract because it is done. You know what I mean? That, that's how dependable he's been and how honest he is. If, if a problem comes up, he's telling me ASAP so that we can make adjustments and figure out some of the other ones hid the problems trying to fix the problems and then two weeks later we can't fix the problem now we lost two weeks you know now we got to go find another lender you know what I mean and we're two weeks behind and it's just a jacked up deal that happened several times to me you know what I mean so I think just staying on top of it communicating with